Hi guys! So I'm still in this hotel in West Virginia and I shot an elf haul here. My voice is a little raspy, but I wanted to show you guys what's in my travel makeup bag. And I had sort of big designs for this video. I thought I'm going to pack really thoughtfully and then when I share what's in my makeup bag it's going to be like a really helpful travel packing list. But instead I overslept and also my cat was acting kind of crazy so I was having to spend some time with him the morning I was leaving. So I ended up just throwing things into this bag. So I thought I'd show you anyway that this is what I hurriedly packed, but it is a lot of my favorite things because that's what I grabbed. So I think it's still going to be fun to go through. So first up, I have a Maybelline Master Glaze in Pink Fever. This is a really nice cream blush. I have this on today. I love this. Uh, I use this with the e.l.f. Small Stipple Brush. I apply it directly to my face and then I blend it out with this brush and I think that this is so great. And then so obviously I have this stipple brush as well. For my foundation, I brought this which is a cocktail of Josie Marin Argan Daily Moisturizer with Clarins Tinted daily sunscreen because the Clarins is a little too dark and not that moisturizing and the Josie Marin is very, I find it to be almost too oily on my skin, but combined they're great and this pump is really nice for travel. So that's what I brought for my foundation and I'm wearing that today. This is a little pod of Urban Decay Anti-Aging Eyeshadow Primer Potion. I used this today and I'll use it tomorrow and then it will go in the trash, but these pod samples are really nice for traveling. This is a Marvelous Moxie lip gloss. This is Birthday Babe. My mom gave me this because she didn't think she would use it. I'm going to try it on. I already have lipstick on, but I'm going to try this on. It's sort of a peachy color. Oh, I like that. I like it. It feels very similar to the Buxom glosses. Then this is the lip stick that I had on before. This is a liquid lipstick by Rimmel. Their Show Off Lip Lacquer in Nova. And I love this. This is just a perfect pink. It's just a really, really nice formula and color and one of my favorites of these Rimmel lipsticks. I have my Urban Decay Naked Skin Ultra Definition Powder Foundation in Fair Neutral. This I absolutely love. I love to use this as a setting powder or it can just be a foundation but it settles on the skin in a really nice way. This is Benefit Roller Lash Mascara, one of my favorites. And then I brought as well Definiseal's Waterproof. So in case I wanted just regular mascara or waterproof mascara. But both of these are really nice formulas. And then of course I have an eyelash curler to use with them. This is by Bare Minerals. It's their, their Touch Up Veil. And it is SPF 15. And I like to use this setting powder all over the face, although it can be a little too powdery, um, but I really do like this for setting under eye area. And there it is. I love this, obviously. I've used a ton of it. This is the only eyeshadow brush I brought, somehow. Uh, so that's all I used today, and it was pretty easy. The eyeshadow that I have on is from the Urban Decay Naked Basics. This is what that looks like. The black one smashed, but today I used Walk of Shame, Naked 2, and a little bit of Venus. But this is an awesome travel palette because it's just so easy. And I was able to do it just with this one brush. So another brush, I didn't use this today, but this is a MAC uh, blush brush. I like this one, it's an angled blush brush. But since I used the cream product for my blush, I didn't need this, so I don't know why I brought it. Although, now I have an e.l.f blush with me, so maybe I'll use that tomorrow. This is the Urban Decay All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray. I'm actually going to put some on because I didn't yet. Ooh, I love it. Love this. I really don't feel like I'm done until I spray this on my face. And the cool thing about this little sample size is that the top comes off so you can refill this. This is a CoverGirl lipstick in Darling. This is actually a similar color to the to Nova. Let me swatch these side by side. Yeah, they're really similar. Nova's just a little bit of a brighter pink. This is Nova on the top, then this is Darling. But these two layered would actually be amazing, and that would last all day, because these CoverGirl lipsticks stain, and so do these. So these would be a nice combo. This is the under eye concealer that I brought. This is the Age Rewind 
by Maybelline. My color is Fair. And this is great for travel because you can use this applicator to blend it out too. Although I brought a multitasker mini brush from Sephora, which is perfect for concealer. So these two I used together. I guess I forgot that I had this pod with me because I also brought an Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion Little Mini, which I didn't need to bring. I brought a lip liner from Rimmel. This is one of their jelly liners, which I think were pretty short-lived. These are not available anymore. This is in the color Starlet. And this I actually use just as a lipstick because it's not it's like too wet to be a lip liner. There it is right there. It's a nice everyday kind of color. Too many lip things. This is another little mini brush. This came with this, I think. Uh, it's a tiny bare minerals br brush, but I actually used this to set my foundation with this today, uh, and it worked great. This is a little brow product I'm trying to use up from Maybelline. It's uh, a spoolie on one side and then sort of a waxy pencil. It's not an ideal color, and I also don't love the look, but I'll, I'll definitely use this up. And then I brought way too many eyeliners because I had eyeliners packed and then I packed more because I forgot. So I have two inner corner, inner rim highlights. One is the highlighter color from L'Oreal and one is pink champagne from Mali. I have two brown liners. One is a Kat Von D and one is a Jordana. And then I have two more colorful liners. One is Lucky from Urban Decay. One is Rockstar from Urban Decay. And then I have the Rehab Pencil from Urban Decay, which is what I have on my lower lash line today. So that's everything I brought for my trip. And apologies again for my strange voice today. Um, but I hope this was fun. Thank you so much for subscribing, for commenting, for watching. You are great. Enjoy your day. Bye-bye.